shouldn't be surprised, Kyle, given it took you three years to make a screwdriver, but really, two years and $5,000 to plan and build a table that... Not this table. <laughs> this table. Oh. oh. Kyle set out with a simple goal, to use his engineering know-how and AMD's money to build the world's most powerful gaming table. One computer, not enough. Two computers, sounds good. All that remains is to see if we can get through the rest of this without killing each other. You cut this one. The tubing kind of looks Can you be less of a downer? What? It's AMD $5,000 Ultimate Tech Upgrade, baby! Roll the intro. Do 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 do. Guess who's back, guys? It's AMD with another chance to win a sick giveaway. They're giving away three of their Ryzen 8700G processors. All you've got to do is head to our Twitter at the link down below. Thanks again to AMD for sponsoring this series. Before we build the table, I need to see how much stolen goods there is here. Now, you planned for me to be in this room, so yes. obviously there's not going to be anything here. No, there's no stolen stuff in my house. Canned goods, huh? Yes, my wife and I used to can a lot. Um, we've stopped. Is that a euphemism? For what? You stopped when you got married, I guess? No, when we had kids. Did, did I miss something? <laughs> Am I getting old? This area is like kid central, mate. Um, it's... My kid was the first product tester for that thing. Realistically yeah. though, I'm not upset about this. What I'm upset about That's is that I engineering sample. don't see the ABCs of gaming. It's in the kids' bedroom. Because we read it to them every night before they go to sleep. You do not. <laughs> This used to be like Lego Dimensions all the way across there. All my PS2 games, PS3, PS4, Wii games. Um, but now it's just kid stuff. So you see there is hope. You noticed he has a wife, right? What? <laughs> Am I missing every single jab you do? See, my wife got it, but like Elijah gets it. I don't freaking... What do you mean there's hope? Is this an old plasma? Yes. Wow. So I had a choice of building two computers or upgrading the TV. I haven't won a TV in the last three Christmas parties. And I'm hoping to win a TV at some point. It does the job as 1080p. So my sound system is, I think, a Best Buy special. It's precision order. I wouldn't swear by it. It produces sound. <laughs> it's definitely not stolen from work. Uh, yeah. I mean, um, our company didn't exist when that TV came out. <laughs> Realistically, I wasn't going to find anything until the tech corner. Fiber optic display port cable. AMD paid for it. Oh, oh, it's part of okay. Yeah, it's right, part right, of the right, upgrade. Right. There's no way that you're not over your allocation of screwdrivers. Hold on, this is the second one that was made. Stolen was, it. No, that's a test thing. How can I make the screwdriver and not? You don't even work you in gave this department. That to us. I specifically put as much LTT merch everywhere, sprinkled around the house. So every time the camera pans, there's LTT merch. And this guy's whining about how much LTT merch. I'm clothed by your company. <laughs> so I won this at the Christmas party before Linus says this is his. I broke the power switch when I assembled it. And to open this again is such a pain in the freaking bum hole that Instead of trying to open it again, I just pulled the wires out and now I hotwire the PC to turn it on and off. The LTT cap was in that whole B-roll frame. I, I'm not good with caps, mate. You don't even take stuff that you're gonna use? Then why did you shave? There is, what, uh, all right. Why this, did he shave? This will be the video where I explain it then. I booked a hydrofacial. What the freak's a hydrofacial? It's like a facial treatment. The point is, that it costs the same whether they just do half of your face or whether they do your whole face. Now, I don't want to troll Origin, but their systems, not that cheap. There's no way you bought this. No, one at a Christmas party. No. Wait, is this one of those laptops that has the two power bricks? The two power bricks, it weighs a ton. It's literally got like desktop hardware in it. You know, when you said you were a gamer, I thought you might play somewhat more advanced games. I guess this makes sense though. Three years to design I a mean, screwdriver. I paid for that. One of those might be from the office. It was cheaper than buying a server rack, okay? It works. Look, this even slides in and out. Well, you could have just stolen one from work like everything else. No, I didn't steal anything from work. You found nothing from work that I've stolen. Note his phrasing. You found nothing from work that I've stolen. Ah, we found Kyle's games. Those were the kids' games upstairs. Yes. I understand now. Wow, no wonder you need a gaming table. Uh, there's more there. For all these miniatures that you haven't bothered to paint. The game's just as functional if you just play with the gray ones, right? Yes, eventually I'll paint it. I've only been in this house for about 40 minutes and I've already heard I'll get to it enough times to last an entire marriage. 
How long did it take you to upgrade your first house? Upgrade it? Yeah, before you employed the whole company to work on your new one? Yeah, it took a while. So, I mean, you prioritize your own stuff. This is nice. This was a Kickstarter, actually. Oh. Uh, we needed a custom board gaming solution. And this is just steel frame with shelves that you can change the height. This cost, uh, after shipping, about $1,300. It's a lot of money for a shelf. Be careful. What? I know. No, 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 What? This is finished no, no, wood. No, 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 no. It's finished okay. wood. Painstakingly okay. sanded and polished. I get it. Did but I touch no, anything? Okay, listen, bro, but you're like, let's go, let's sand it, YOLO, all the freaking time with. You can't do this with this thing. It took like two freaking years. Let the record show how carefully I lifted this without so much as jostling it against anything else. Let the record show of all the times Linus has there. dropped. Oh, oh my, how do you do that? You just... Let the record show, okay, that there are not a lot of dings and scratches on the stuff in my house. I know when to be careful with something. What are you talking about? Isn't there massive gouges in your bedroom? Oh, oh my. That didn't sound good. <laughs> this is a good time to explain how this table came to be. Well, when a daddy tree loves a mummy tree. Oh, pardon me, I've... Uh, let the record show, it was not me who dropped anything. All I was saying is if it doesn't fit in the hole, find a different hole. Don't try and force it into the hole. Okay, I, I literally explained. Kyle, look, here, have a seat. I'm calm. Okay, look, I'm calm. Sit on your, no, sit but, on your calmness blanket. No, but the, I can't sit because my ass is full of stuff. <laughs> you know, <laughs> <laughs> okay, my back pockets are full of stuff. <laughs> That's not better. I have two screws. <laughs> if you have a problem, just get a colostomy bag. I gotta be honest with you. Uh, this does not appear to be pre-tapped. I don't see a oh, place where this goes. No. Oh yeah, it doesn't go in there. Sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna have to take the L on that one. Um, no, you need to put them in this. We, no, we can understand okay. now that it's very obvious. When designing this table, I did what I always do. I kind of look for inspiration. So I did a Google search for what's already out there and kind of came up with an amalgamation of two that I really liked. I knew I wanted a table that was a poker style table, one with a recessed plane surface. However, I like my tables to be multifunctional, so I also wanted to have a system that I can put on top, very similar to the table that we destroyed in the intro, where you could have a board game in the middle and you can put the topper on top and now have a normal dining room table. Now, the question is, what do you do with that topper when you're playing? Because if you notice the big topper that Linus and Elijah walked in earlier in the video, when we had to take it off the table, it needed two people, and then we had to like put it against the wall and was awkward as flip. So the first inspiration was from a fellow Canadian by the name of Coyote Gaming, if I butchered the name, whatever. They designed a system to house the table toppers within the legs of the table, which is way better than just throwing it on the floor. Now, oh. eventually, eventually I will have dividers that will hold this in place. You can see how the actual slats rest. Yeah. There'll be three on this side and three on this side. You will have a perfect triangle in between the three leaves from each side. So you're going to put a computer there. So I designed it with one computer in here to slide in. Okay. But then I thought, well, the other leg is going to be awfully lonely. So we may as well just make it symmetrical and stick another one of these on the other flipping side. Huh. Nice legs. Thank you. I work on them every day. <laughs> What's the next piece? Nim, 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 nim. Oh. Ready? Yep. Oh, it fell into one slot. That's not in mine. <laughs> you are not wrong. That's the nicest thing he's ever said to me. Oh, I numbered it. Oh. Yeah, that looked pretty cool. Hey, nice, nice. Yee. Oh my gosh, it took me too long to get. <laughs> These are uh, six-sided dice, right? So if you turn them, if you turn them up like on one of the things, there's numbers. See, that's why I thought they were dice. Do you roll them like as a bottle flip or like? A... Oh balls! No, can you have four and Linus have one, please? Okay, well here's two. No, no, I want. No, no, oh my! Give him number four. You take number one. That's not number four. I take four. number one. Where's your bathroom? Now is probably a good time to talk about the hardware that's holding everything together. What we have is these threaded inserts with these horizontal bars that thread in to the machine screw side of the threaded insert. Then you face this detent portion upright 
and then you insert these into something that rests over here. Then it goes into, uh, oh, oh. Oh God. I think the wood took less damage than the ceiling. You could just have us move stuff and then it just might not get damaged. Ooh, got him. Oh. Oh. You put this inside the hole here and just slide it in and it sits there. All that's needed is a grub screw inside the top of this and it holds. Legendary back force, machine screw, not even holding it. LTTstore.com, knock to a screwdriver. It's on there now. Now I need you to drop these inside the big hole with the holy side facing the Audi side. Okay, let me check if it's the holy side. I guess we got it. Nice. <laughs> I'm just gonna do the other one because this is gonna be quicker. It's called parallelization. Maybe we would have finished the screwdriver faster if you'd used it. If I remember correctly, someone had a midlife crisis halfway through it and made me redesign part of the freaking uh, bit storage system. Sorry, I have a lot of pent up rage. I don't like all this fighting. No, it's good. It's not real fighting. <laughs> We're not really gonna get divorced. That's what my last parents said. <laughs> Quick question for you. Were we supposed to put the dowly things in? On some of them, there's more holes drilled than are needed. <laughs> What's your name, Elijah? <laughs> <laughs> I put like five extra holes in someone's wall. What? He's actually really nice. Yeah, he's so he's nice. Such a nice guy. Otherwise, Elijah wouldn't have walked out of there in one piece after we get to his house. Don't move it! Is this a bad time for another Madagascar reference? Oh. <laughs> move it! I like to move it, move it. Oh, King Julian! Oh. <laughs> That's not screwing in very nicely. What we need to do right now is flip. Yeah. Why are the two strong guys on one side? Oh, oh lordy. Whoa. Looks good. Thank you. Is that this spot? What happened? No, if he sees it, he'll never unsee it. I am going to see it the second you move your hand anyway. He's standing there all day. <laughs> hey, sweetie, we might need the... the, the, the... Um, that is a beautiful table. Yeah, Thank you, we put great. it together. Oh, wait, I'm sure you worked really hard. Yeah, yeah, we did, yeah. I just heard giggling and swearing upstairs. Really? Because the only person you were up there with was uh, the baby. <laughs> The last thing that needs to happen is I need to put like a million pocket screws all around the bottom of the table to hold the rails to the plywood. You know that it's not a pool table though, right? Uh, so why do you need pocket screws? There's no pockets. Can't argue with that logic, Linus Sebastian, folks. He'll be here all day. <laughs> yeah, I know. There is way more extras than just the table on Floatplane. LMG.GG slash Floatplane. Go check it out. Basically me, Kyle, and Linus kill each other for an hour. It's great. I have a really important question. How are we gonna measure and trace out on the fabric now that you've put the whole table together? I thought we were gonna trace the plywood onto the fabric. Uh, that sounds like a you problem? It's your table, it's a you problem. You'll figure it out, my angel, you're really smart. He seems stressed. No, I'm fine. I'm not stressed. This is just my Does he have like a favorite meal or something? I'm fine. Our problem here is that we don't have an edge that we can trust. Like typically that's my crutch is I'll just grab one that I can say, okay, yeah, yeah that's definitely straight, but this one is just ragged as hell. I don't yeah. think it's even gonna fit under there. Yeah, that was him cutting it at work with a random pair of scissors. Oh. So that means we are going from scratch ass balls here. <laughs> what? Kyle? Yep. I really hate to be that guy. What, what's up? But I genuinely think that we should probably be popping this off. And the best way to tension this it's what? probably gonna be to run the screws through it. Why? No, why do you need to tension it? Look at it. I, I'm looking at it! This is something you knew already, isn't it? We talked about it, yeah. You put under, and now it's fine. Oh, I'm gonna just pick up my cards. Well, Here's what we're gonna do. Craft. Elijah and I are gonna go build some computers. And Kyle is gonna undo a lot of screws. I was hoping to build a computer today. But you didn't finish the table, so. You decided I to didn't. build the camera. Nick Light did. Uh, Don't. He suggested it. This is your video. You had full thing to be like, For no, fun, we've decided to do this told, as a challenge. You I'm going to be building sorry, Kyle's machine while that it was Elijah. A 30 minute Come build. on, I'm here, Elijah! <laughs> builds Leone's. Except I apparently am getting thrown a bit of a curveball because I have to pull the AIO cooler out of Kyle's current PC and you just have to build a computer. Yes. Also, we both have only this space to work. That's fine, I call the table. Also, curveball for you. 
Leone has some hard drives inside her machine that she would like inside hers. Nice. He called Leone's machine. This is mine. Yeah, it buddy. was. It has an asset tag for this computer. Give it. Man, these are nice machines. Ryzen 7 7700X, eight cores, Zen 4, B650 IAORUS Ultra motherboard. I gotta say, I'm finding the size of these computers a little confusing given that we're using uh, little tiny motherboards, but Shout out Kyle, chivalrous. Almost every other his and hers element of these upgrades that I've seen before, she has gotten a like B tier upgrade while he has kept the best stuff for himself. These are both the same so far. Yeah, I think they're both the same throughout, but we'll find out I guess as we go. See, he's not all bad. Hear that Kyle? I have been downstairs five minutes and I think I've heard five insults. Apparently I chose a more powerful computer for me and then threw my wife under the bus and got her some cheap That's shit. not at all like, what we said. Whoa, 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 that's not what at all we said, but thanks for admitting it. Hey Kyle, what kind of display did you get? Was it a monitor or a projector? <laughs> Brother, look, I got the alien, I got the <laughs> alienware one that ploof. Kyle. Suck it. What? I know what kind of display you got. Okay, then why did you ask? Cause you're projecting. I don't know what that means. I don't see built computers. Why don't you talk less and work more? I don't see a finished table. That's your fault! Wow! That's your fault! Damn! I didn't know he got an oven as an upgrade. Cause you're getting roasted! <laughs> Good choice of RAM though. DDR5 6000 CL32. Well configured system. You got help with this, hey? Do you doubt my ability so much that I can't come up with a spec? He did get help, didn't he? No, I didn't. They also got the 990 Pro, the two terabyte version in each of these. Kyle's is already pre-installed, so Linus has a bit of an advantage. Um, but yeah, that's two terabytes for gaming. That's perfect now, like that's a lot of storage. I really did draw the short straw here. In order to get this AIO out, I have to get at a whole bunch of stuff behind this motherboard. This computer is coming completely apart. Speaking of hardware he paid for, there is no way that this is under budget. What's not under budget? I'm talking about that I don't think you're within budget. Which, which part? Which part? The part where you've got like two high-end gaming PCs. I thought I saw a 7900 series GPU in one of them. Yeah. I can promise you right now, the computers are within budget. I paid for the entire board game table myself. Ah, uh, okay, that makes sense. See you later. No, please, I just, I literally just oh. paid for house cleaning, okay? <laughs> To be clear, Kyle already had a pretty decent machine. Ryzen 2600X, 1080 Ti. It's just that the new stuff is a lot better. When I first got this upgrade, I was playing on Thunderbolt, but learning from this guy's mistakes, I just plan to do straight optical cables. So that's why we have that optical cable and that's why that panel's off the wall. Uh, well, that panel's off the wall because I haven't closed that panel from when I got heat installed three years ago. Okay, you should have um, said that it's off so that we can run cables. Yes, it's off because we can run cables. So the other side of that hole that we just shot comes out on the other side of this wall. So all we have to do is run the cable down across the floor to the computers that will sit underneath the table. <laughs> now it's time to figure out where all these SSDs are gonna go. Hey Kyle, Yep. do you have Three SSD slots on you? Oh, yeah, there's, there's one, one on the back. One in the back, and then I already have one SSD in there, and I believe one can go on the underside of this carrier oh, board. Oh, God. He's trying really hard to contribute right now. He's doing good. I mean, I can just go. Kyle, you like, are walking, living, breathing like, content. Why do I feel like you're um, making content? No, shut the f. <laughs> no, what's the, what's the word when you. Fuck? Taking the piss? No, not taking. <laughs> um, Patronize? Thank you. That one. Oh, I love America. <laughs> Okay, well, we, we should stop. I'm not cutting it. No, no, no. The last time I cut this fabric put us in the situation we're in right now. How's it going? Uh, um, I don't want to say you're right just yet. <laughs> I just was genuinely wondering how it's going. Because check this out. Yeah, that's awesome. That's literally exactly what you want. And now we don't even have to get the cut perfect because we can just have no, a leg it You just hide all of it, yeah. How are these cases to build in so far? Uh, they're triangular. There is only one case in the world that would fit the exact design that I did. And that's that one. What it, are you compensating for? Nothing, because um, I have three kids, so it works, obviously. <laughs> oh, did you test fit if you have enough eight pin power connectors for your graphics card on this power supply? Yes, we do. Well, I have different power supplies. Okay, let's use that one then. 
Before you use a modular cable from one power supply on another, you need to make 100% damn good and sure that they use the same pinout because otherwise you will destroy what is on the other end Which of it. Which is why I asked them to check it. RMI and AXI do not use the same pinout, unfortunately. Oh, fudge. Um, RMI may be able to handle the high transients of this thing though. If I have to extract the power supply, then I guess I will. When you said, did I test fit everything, it was just user error because you could have moved that bracket a little bit to the left. But I'm saying if you had test fitted it, that bracket would have already been moved. Yeah, but I moved it on that one, but not this one because I haven't built on this one. Don't blame the fact that you don't know how to use the case on me. Did you read the manual? It's in Chinese, but did you read it? <laughs> I'm not an asshole, but it's funny. <laughs> would you guys talk you smack about me while I was downstairs? We didn't actually. Please cut to the part where they were talking smack about how I spec these two machines. Shout out Kyle. These are both the same so far. I can't wait till he watches this video. I know. <laughs> For his wife's system, we have the RX 7800 XT. In this case, it actually mounts vertically along this side here. So he did give her the worst system. Oh, that's I'm true. I'm pretty yeah. sure I saw 7900 XTX in his. I guess, okay. For the difference in price, they could have both gotten XTs, but no, he had to have the top of the line. I see how it is. I take back all the nice things I said before. My wife doesn't do as much gaming as I do. Maybe uh, she'd game more I, if she I, had I, a I, decent I, GPU. Yeah. Hey Glenn, if you want to see power supply depinning, it's really cool. <laughs> Just kidding, it sucks. <laughs> Four to eight. Yep. All right, rock on. We nice. just made this cable work. Oh, you see this? Oh my God. What? Do you have a C19 power cable? <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? All right, I have a 1250 watt in my old case. I'll just bring it up. What? You're joking. It's 10 years old. Oh. It's it's an FXX power supply when FX... XFX. When they still used to be a thing, which is why I didn't want to use it. Okay, this power supply might be 13 years old, but this thing freaking slaps. It's 80 plus gold, 1250 watts. It's actually not even that big. Like it's that much shorter than the 1500 watt that I just pulled out of here. And it's got a hybrid fan mode thing. It's Seasonic made. Here's something cool. Remember when we did that video on that super cool Honeywell PTM 7950 thermal pad material that was like a thermal pad that performed better than thermal paste? Well, guess what? We got in touch with the distributor. This is actually Kyle's doing. And we are gonna be selling this, right? On LTT store? Half of that. Half of this, okay. Last it would be a little bit too expensive. Ah, got it, anyway. We're also gonna be selling individual 60 by 60 pads if you don't wanna cut it. And when I say 60, I mean 60 millimeters. But basically, we're gonna have a legit source for this stuff that's actually somewhat reasonably priced for a change. So you can use this super cool thermal pad material. I cut it way too big, oh my goodness, for your CPU. I cannot, for the life of me, figure out how to peel these stupid thermal pads anymore. Throwing it in your fridge for at least a couple of hours before you begin. What? It's too warm, it's a phase change material, and it's too liquidy right now. Oh yes, 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 okay. Boop, 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 boop. Phase change! You wanna see if it posts? Post it! You're the host with the most post. Then we shall call you Malone. <laughs> hey, posted! Man. This thing is even easy to cable manage in too, cause like you just hide everything behind your sexy graphics card. Yup. So easy. All right, we're booting it. Three, two. That's a positive sign. It's three drives, let's go. Dude, these are heavy. So this is it. This is it. Final form, baby. It's rock solid, man. So, um, just across the hallway or? Yeah, it's just over the floor. Like, I'm, no, no, I, I just mean in, in the long run. Probably just across the floor and just put like a stepping pad or something. Um, Any other ideas? I realize that this is a little late for me to be coming to this realization, yeah. but these computers being in the table serves no purpose at all. No. You could just as easily just huck them in the yes. network closet yes. and then you'd achieve all the same absolutely. noise and, and yeah. cooling benefits uh, uh, upstairs. Absolutely. It, but how cool is it to have two computers and a board gaming table? Actually, I take that back. We play D&D. A lot, and even though we play in person, mm -hmm. we use an online program to move the characters around. Mm -hmm. A company called Wormwood makes pretty much the exact same top. I reverse engineered the top from videos they made of how they build it. So you ripped it off, kind of, I reverse engineered it. I, 
So you ripped it off. I got so close that we found out we we're in breach of a patent that they just filed. <laughs> In my defense, they hadn't done the patent when I started this project. It's been fairly recent. So we reached out to them and they were good sports. And because it's for personal use, they were okay with it. Okay. And they were even kind enough to send over what I consider, in my humble opinion, to be the main reason why I chose the top is the ability to have magnetic at attachable accessories. Okay. Now, you obviously don't want water when you're gaming, right? right? Obviously, that would be stupid. Mm. Oh, you want to you want to move it? Oh. Okay, that's pretty cool. You want it on the inside? No problem. And to show you how close I got to their design, this is from them. This is really cool. Yep. But doesn't explain why we need a computer in the table. So because we play D&D online, we yeah. each need screens. I see. So you know how you did your car and you have those USB-C powered screens? Yes. I'm going to embed those into wood play surfaces, have them magnet into the table and run the USB-C connector into Mr. USB-C over here. Okay, won't you work on that one, but you can plug it into the back of the GPU. Or the back of the GPU. Yes. Yeah. Obviously that's not going to happen now. Right, but because the technology doesn't exist. I will figure out a way and then we can talk about it. But right now they're going to the table because they're going to look sick. Cool. Okay. That looks awesome though. I'm going to take some monitors and new peripherals and I'm going to install them upstairs. Sounds good. All right, that's a good idea. See you later. Bye. I found Kyle's new monitors, but I'm not really sure what the configuration is supposed to be. Kyle. Yes. So you need that as your secondary, even though you have a 34 inch ultra wide QD OLED. Yeah, absolutely. This is a 165. 165 right? when you overclock it, yes. Oh, okay. Pretty sick monitor. What games do you guys play together? Uh, what's that game called where Baldur's you- Baldur's Gate 3. No, I play Baldur's it Gate 3. It takes two. Yeah, it takes two. Oh, we play it, it wow. takes two. It only took me two guesses. We uh, play Minecraft together. These, are, these systems are a little overpowered for it takes two in Minecraft. That's fair. Um, I used to play WoW before my guild Okay, quit. it's a little overpowered for WoW. Can you tell me something you're gonna run that justifies the 7900 XTX? Doom Eternal? Cyberpunk? Because that's not optimized. I mean, yeah, are you gonna play it? <laughs> no. You gotta love that AMD money. It's gonna flex it, man. For the past few weeks, I haven't been playing games. I've been building board game tables. Yeah, I spend a lot more time setting up my gaming setup than gaming these days. <laughs> I get it. It's been a while since I've looked at one of these. I'm sure I can figure out how to put it together. 3440 by 1440. 165 hertz. This thing's awesome though. 1000 nits peak brightness HDR. The only problem for Kyle is that this is the kind of monitor that until you've seen it, you don't really feel like, I don't really need that, you know, right? But she's gonna be right next to it, seeing it. I think he's gonna end up with two. Bro, not all over my new screen, I have kids. They don't use this keyboard. Yeah, they do. These are super cool. We had quite a few people ask us, hey, we've seen you use optical display port and optical HDMI cables to run a long distance display a lot of times, but what about USB? These are from Monoprice. It's called the Blackbird 4K, and this one will do up to 50 meters over a Cat 5E cable, and then all you gotta do is plug in power at both ends, and it'll carry up to four USB 2 devices. So that's perfect for mice and keyboards and things like that, even though it isn't gonna have the kind of speed that you would want for say, you know, a USB external SSD. Of course, I mean, Kyle, do you even need that up here? Or this is just for gaming. This is just for gaming. Then who cares? Wiggle the cable. No, not too much. Just is give it, it this a one? Yeah. Oh, good job. Oh, okay, oh, I got oh, it, oh. I got it. Thanks, 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 stop, stop. Okay, stop, good job. Dad, we're ready. <laughs> Oh, you know what he does need us to do though? He needs us to see if that monitor turns on. If you guys see anything turn on on there, then you're gonna shout, it's working, okay? Hey, we have one working computer. Let's go. All I had to do was be the one who touched it. Oh, wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. I see, I see a crime being committed over here. I'm actually in the building and someone other than me is reading the ABCs of gaming for bedtime story. Am I allowed to read it? No. All right, we'll let your mom do it then. Yes. How many more minutes? That do I need your dad for? Yeah. Not so long that he can't come up and tuck you in, okay? Deal? Yeah. Okay. You can All right. Read. I can read? Okay, okay, okay. B is for button. 
Pushing these is fun to do. Which one's blue? Do you know? <gasps> Good job! We've determined that it's probably a GPU driver issue right now on Elijah's machine because Kyle didn't run DDU, so he's got both AMD's drivers and uh, their <clears throat> friendly competitor. So we're doing a proper driver install and we're pretty sure that once that's done, we're ready to go. But hey, look at this. All three displays are lit and listen to that. No noise, besides my server. <laughs> why is that there? I haven't Kyle, move it downstairs. Yeah, I can't, I'm not, not now, later. This looks amazing. Is this just staged for B-roll and all that? Yeah, pretty, well, pretty much. It's gonna look freaking awesome. I can't believe how this setup turned out. We got the computers in, they're on the rails. The finish on the wood looks amazing. The accessories just pop on and off. Oh man, speaking of pop, that red surface turned out absolutely perfect. I can't believe how well it goes with the table. And while the cable management to the upstairs might need a little work, there's no denying the results. That is a night and day difference up there. We've got dual monitors on Kyle's setup with a 3440 by 1440 QD OLED and I mean, what is still a pretty sick gaming monitor as a secondary. Man, does HDR look good on this thing. And even Leone's machine, in spite of being a hand-me-down special, looks and performs awesome. So thank you so much, AMD. This ultimate tech upgrade might have been a bit of a slog. <laughs> But we got through it and look, neither of us is dead. Yeah. I mean, I mean we might Elijah's have lost not here. We might have lost Elijah. <laughs> if you guys enjoyed this video, check out one of our other AMD Ultimate Tech Upgrades. Uh, maybe Adam's if you enjoy the chaotic energy. <laughs>